The reason why I started working out was because I was a very depressed person. I've dealt with depression of my life. So I'm originally from the Dominican Republic and I came to the United States when I was 13 years old. Coming to the United States was definitely a challenge because I didn't know any English. It's hard where, as a kid, you had to be an adult because I had to work. I've been working since 17 and independence is 17. I've known how it is to not have a penny in your pocket and, and struggle being hungry because I'm a very proud person and I promised to myself that I was gonna stay here and I was gonna show, you know, I was gonna show not only my parents, but I was gonna show myself that I could do it. Almost two years ago, I just hit rock bottom. I used exercise as a form of, as a drug to, you know, as a form of relieving or curing my depression. I've known what it is not to be happy. You know, I know what it is to be Being depressed is not, it's not something that you can control. Being depressed is not something that, it, it's, it's a word that people use a lot, and I don't think people really understand what it is to be depressed, what it is to not want to wake up in the morning, not wanting to live, not having any motivation whatsoever to even breathe and get out there to just perform your daily activities. So I was one of those girls who had a lot of self-image issues and I feel that that's a way of disrespecting yourself because you should, you should be your own person. You should love yourself and do things that you want to do because you want to do them, not because a magazine is telling you how to look. Currently I'm a personal trainer, motivator, and activist of women's rights. I'm trying to teach a different way of doing things on how to be healthy. Not only work out just to look good, but work out to feel good inside. There's more to fitness than just a body, than a six pack. It's more than that. It's about health. It's about getting your life together. It's about being healthy mentally, emotionally, physically, being strong, being powerful, being independent. I feel like I have the responsibility of not only sharing my journey, but sharing the information that I know. I am very grateful at the fact that I found something that gave me the push that I needed to feel better. I know there's a lot of women out there who are depressed right now with self-image issues. There's a lot of women out there who are in the shoes that I was a year and a half ago. In five, 10, whatever years, I wanna change the world. I just don't wanna be another girl who has a good body. I wanna be the reason why Many girls and many women are feeling better about themselves, feel highly about themselves. The day I die, I want to die with a purpose. I want to pass and I want to leave this world knowing that I change lives. It is time that we take control of our own decisions of how we want to look. We're not perfect. I'm not perfect. Nobody's perfect. You should be, you should be comfortable with who you are as a person.